Okay, hello everybody and welcome back to Mass Effect Andromeda where my headphones are stuck and I think today we're gonna do uh oh maybe we should go talk to Sam about the unlocked memory. Uh and we could talk to PB so we could do PB's as I say we should do Either Liam or Mit or PB or Jaws. Jaws would be good. <clears throat> I kind of want to do that. Let's actually do Jaws really quick. And uh, let me really quick run and see if Sam's got anything new to say. You have AVP outstanding Pathfinder. What's that exactly? I don't remember. No talk. They kind of stopped talking pretty quickly. Pretty quickly. In. So that's kind of a bummer. Uh, let's see. We have two mils. So maybe we should get a commerce. Oh. Market dominance. Special inventories. I really don't care about any of this, to be honest. So that's cool. Um, but yeah, let's go talk to Sam. I don't think anybody else. Maybe we can see pop in and see what Lexi's doing. Okay. Thanks, Sam. Nothing more. Let's see. I did get... Uh, there we go. We got a... I don't know which one it was, but... Oh, there it is. There it is. I got the, uh... Ascension. The, sorry, Ascension. I remember. Um... Wow. So, Kadara and Elodin are pretty... I wonder... I mean, I thought... I thought, like, Elodin still has little side quests. So, I thought that was gonna be like, now you have 98, you know, and now you have 98.2%. That's what it kind of seemed like, but nope. I, apparently, just doing the big stuff is what... is all you need to do. But... I don't remember. What do I need to do for Eos? Five cryopods available for awakening. Oh my gosh, is that my AVP? Jeez, I can awaken like five more? Jeez. Uh, nope, you're not in there. Oh, this is the bathroom. Not. Not the medical bay. How's it going? Right up. Okay, bye. I'll let you get back to it. I'll be here if you need me. Yeah, there's really no reason to talk to your crewmates at this point until you further the mission, I guess. Let's see, you guys are gonna... Oh, wait, we can... I forgot, I gotta check these. Oh, they're not... They don't update? Man, I thought those were gonna update regularly. Okay, well then. <laughs> disappointment after disappointment. Go, go. Let's actually do something. Like, where does Joel want me to go? Joel. Thaldir on Havarl. Still don't have any clues on the Solarian arc. Why isn't my... Come on. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, that no, it doesn't. Okay. Havarl. I mean... I could get the next part of the Archon thing while I'm here. Yeah, no, let's just go to Havarl. Havarl, Havarl, Havarl. It's the thing in this game that just 
planet hop anyway, so doesn't none of it makes sense. Ugh. It's like some missions are like, do you really expect me to follow this like immediately or do you just want me to like like I don't understand? Okay. Skip, skip, skip. Let's do this. A dying planet, a lost sister. I suppose I haven't fixed Tavaro yet, have I? We were thinking about... This is my assault rifle, right? What was that new one I got? The Sandstorm? I thought the weight was supposed to be better. Apparently not. Okay then. Never mind. Not, doesn't really matter, but... Does more damage, but not as much rate of fire. I mean, why not? I bought it. Might as well. Uh, sure. No, not a scope. Oh god, please, not a scope on an assault rifle. And I got my sword, and my black widow, we're good. And we have Jaw, and we have Drac. Okay. Should be good. Entering atmosphere, LZ in sight. I kind of want to get the vaults all done, but at the same time, I'm just like, yeah, you know, they're just... A pain in the tuckus is what they are. Alright, we have Jaw. Jaw. There you are. Okay. Oh, he's not far. We have garnered the attention of the Roka. Axul. Okay. No time, doggy. No time. I really want to see those things up close. What? 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 What was that? That was like a big shadow that went over my head. That was scary. Get it, Joe. The wildlife is so hostile here and like so close together. Sorry, my dog, you probably hear my dog in the background. He's sad because he can't go murder people upstairs. Okay. Alright, you're dead. She'll talk to us? It'll take some convincing, but I think so. Ed Thaldir is the woman who can tell us. The one who can tell us about. Oh, hey! Oh, go! No! Not you guys! Cat. Protect yeah. 
Okay, there we go. I thought you said catch earlier to pet. Okay. Oh. Rokar. They died fighting. Hmm. Axul must have sent them to watch over Thordir. Uh-oh. That does not bode well. Locked. I'll override it. Don't come any closer. Oh, uh, are you okay? We're here to help. What? Why, why am I beeping? Oh, that? No? Don't touch me! You need medical attention. <laughs> it's too late for that. I made sure of it. Your wounds, they're self-inflicted? They can't. I can't go back. I won't. Oh. Hush now, sister. The cat are dead. They can't take you. We won't let them. You sound like him. So confident. So sure. You mean Axul? He saved me. Gave me a chance to live. And die on my own terms. We need to find him, Thordia. It's kind of dark, like, tone-wise, I don't know. <sighs> Color. Ishare. Sorry. Brave one. It's dark, too, in, like, tone of, you know. Even in the end, she was devoted to him. And Axul's using that devotion to spread hate. The only other person who could reach him is the Moshai. I was hoping to keep her out of this. She's always had a blind spot when it comes to That's Axul. what you think. Come on, let's go. I'm not ready to leave yet. Okay, good. Wait, wait for Jaw to set up a meeting? Okay. My family died screaming and bold. I left everyone at our camp that morning to find a passage through the crevice. We were only a day's march for the safety of Techix. I remember feeling hopeful that we might survive our ordeal, and then I smelled burning flesh. I ran toward the smoke, knowing I was already too late. The cat left my family's charred remains in a jumbled heap, but I could still make out faces twisted in agonies. My parents, my brothers and sisters, my husband and our children, all gone. I had never felt so powerless. I scattered their ashes as tears froze against my skin. Then I ran for Techix, where I met Aksu. Was this, uh... Oh! Okay, I was like, this so This was not hers. This was, uh, something else. Well, Jal, hurry up and set up a meeting. Oops, I just tried to do a search function. <laughs> what? Oh. I should probably just go back to... Probably just go back to the, to the tempest. Hmm. To the tempest. We're not in combat. Ugh, I'm gonna walk all the way back out. Maybe our companions think we're in combat? Nope, still think we're in combat. Oh. Oh. Why? Alright, well, I just need to get back to the ship, so... Put a spot over there. Oh! 
This must be what it was like for those ancient Angara, finding strange things in the wilds. It's possible we could discover something new from what you found. We should take it for further analysis. Okay, apparently there's a lot of fetch quests on Havaro. Random ones that probably don't have much payout. Oh god, why am I in combat? Like, I, I checked, there's not even any enemies in the vicinity. Like, there is now, but there weren't back there. Here they come! No, we're going back on the ship. Everybody just calm your titties. Thank you. Man, I was worried it wasn't gonna let me in. Leaving Avaro. Ridge is yours, Pathfinder. I was worried it was gonna be like, nah. You're in combat. Mm. You cannot leave. I'm like, mm, I'm gonna break my controller. I'm gonna break it. I'm gonna snap it in half. Alright, y'all. Hello. Come on. Hello, Suvi. Oh boy, y'all. Anything I can help with? I like you. Sorry. I should get back to things. Sounds good. I don't want to be mean, you know. I want to be. I don't want to. Like, if it was anybody else, I might flirt with them. But Suvi, I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to hurt Suvi. So. You have AVP outstanding. Oh my them. gosh, fine. Let's science pods. Sure, we'll get mining operations. And then military pods, hunting parties. Receive organic material, tech material, consumable supplies. Sure. Uh, sure. Yay. Okay. How many more do we have? Any more? Two crab pods. Okay. Uh, unlocks one extra consumable slot. Requires munitions. Jal! Jal! I'm gonna fight Khan, but you know, Jal. Let's actually see. Suvi, Vetra, Kalo Suvi, Drat, Gil, um, Kora, Jal. So, Jal is. where? Facial reconstructions. Oh, <gasps> that's right. I was actually gonna maybe um, change my eyeshadow. Okay. Okay. So it's down, right? It's in the medical facility. And Jaw and Liam are throwing it up in the common room or the dorm, whatever barracks. This is the bathroom. Okay. Well, let's. Need something? I can stop what I'm doing. I'll see you later, Joel. Stay strong. Oh my strong gosh! What does it take to further? Like seriously, do I like seriously have to wait? Like, what do I have to do? I hate like the on hold stuff. I really just can't. I don't like it. Respect facial reconstruction. And I could customize my twin some more. I don't know. I kind of like. I didn't take as long on his face as I did on hers, but I do like it. Um, 
uh, yeah, uh, just, just want to change the, the makeup, that's all. I, eyeliner, I shadow, wait, no, eyeshadow style, yes. I mean, it, it kind of needs, I mean, it looks cool, but it doesn't really work in the game. It has a hard time rendering. So we have no eyeshadow, crazy eyeshadow, brother's eyeshadow, PB's eyeshadow, third eye eyeshadow, regular eyeshadow, party eyeshadow, I don't even know. I mean, I could try that, but I don't think it's going to render very well. Or maybe it's just because of the style of it before it didn't seem like it rendered very well. Sure. Uh. Oh, yes. I might make a couple changes to my brother before I start the before I start his playthrough eventually. Oh god, have I ruined everything? I will be so angry. But this is a, this is like a major transition loading screen. What have I done? What have I done? Okay. Okay. All right, so it's still on hold, wait for Jal to set up a meeting. Okay. Um. Oh God, what else was there? I talked to Jal. Okay. I mean, I don't really know what to do. I mean, I guess, I guess I could do the next part of that one. Uh, of the main mission, wouldn't that just be dandy, I guess? Maybe then I could have something to talk about with my friends and stuff. <laughs> seem like that much of an important step just pick it up thing but who knows I know I can like finish basically do the main mission and then still go back and do all the other things but it feels really weird to do that I don't really want to do that I might do that with Scott but I think I'll just kind of take it easy with Lyra and Do, do, do how I would normally play a Mass Effect game, which is to make sure I had all my assets and stuff good before I, I went into the final Dara. fight. A lot of these side missions sound intriguing too, but they're not actually that. And they all sound like some of them sound really important, but they just kind of don't measure up, you know? Take so long. Um, where we at? Natural. Uh, wait, on Vold? Thought it was on Kadara. What? There was like a thing I had to pick up. 
Yeah, retrieve the, the cat transponder from the Badlands. Okay. That's what I need to do. Get to the slumps. I think that, yeah, I unlocked that. Is that the consumable slot or just the weapon slot? I don't know. I don't know. And we'll bring Jell and Drac. Sure. Fine. That's fine. It's all fine. It's all good. I'm so glad I don't have to equip them, too. That would be a pain. So much. I'm kind of, I'm still like awake. I don't really need a soda, but I'm going to have one. I'm kind of hungry. So stave off hunger with a soda. Out, 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 out. Now we're out of that area, and it's, oh, close to the, close-ish anyway, to our outpost. Hope the outpost is doing all right. Man, I haven't gone back to Eos in ages. What? Oh. I think it was just like, your nomad's ready. Okay. I don't see any exclamation points in here, so I'm just gonna assume all's well. Feels good to be on solid ground again. You don't feel exposed? The cat. I'm worried everywhere. about in I'd getting interruptions. I'd rather face them down here than stuck in a can up there. Me too, to be honest. I don't know, I feel like you can, especially we are nearing car at this point. The exile camp mentioned in Yafia's logs. We should talk to whoever's in charge and search the area for clues. Search the area for clues. Pathfinder. Then to Rev claimed he buried the cat transponder near this location. Oh, there it is. Oh, that was like whatever. Right? We were Keep an eye out for anything that might be connected to the poisoned Angora. Oh, what? No, I don't even... There's like two different missions going on here, apparently. I don't... I, I know that there was that poisoned Angora thing. Found it. Clearly that's broken. The transponder's power source is drained. So let's juice it up. Turn it on, then Gil can work his magic. Once complete... This should provide us with the Archon's location, and in turn, Meridian's. We're one step closer to building a home in Helios. Sure, kid. Okay. Okay, why was that very sad sounding? Okay, good. I, I was wondering if all I had to do was actually just start the next part. Like, or st do, like, a mission, and then it would, it would trigger Jaws. To keep going. See, the last episode I feel like we did a lot. This episode I feel like we've done deadly squat and it's already 30 minutes in, so this is why I kind of like the hour long stuff. Although, this means that the Jaws, it's probably gonna take like an hour to do Jaws, so. Shoot. <laughs> That's gonna be a funny cut somewhere in the middle there. ready to talk to you about the Ket transmitter. Okay, Kalo, thank you for your... Wait, did I check my email for... Check my email. Oh, speaking with Axel from the Moshai, Jal expressed he wished to meet Axel. It's been a long time since he spoke. He was so changed by the Ket, it was difficult to talk to him. But perhaps enough time has passed, and together we can reason with him. Ever arranged for a meeting at my laboratory on Aya? Please come at your earliest convenience. 
I had diplomatic efforts from Tan. I was wondering how this was going to go. When we left our old home, we never planned on having to negotiate with an alien civilization for a new one. It's vital we placate the Angara and keep them on our side. They've opened an embassy on I, and our diplomatic team is already settling in. I'm counting on you to ensure our success. You've established ties with the resistance leader, the Moshai, and I as governor. Do all you can to learn everything about them and their supporters. The better we understand I as political structures, the more successful we'll be gaining their help colonizing Hines. Well, have your diplomats do that. Matriarch credits. Ha 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 ha! It was a scam. Do me a favor, don't tell that. I remember that. Uh, speak with the Moshe on Aya. No orbits in Kazara. Yay, we literally just had nothing else. To, I mean, just. Ugh. Come on, controller, you can do it. It's having troubles sometimes. Come on. Where is it? Aya? Aya, there it is. Come on, like, sir. I'm like, what the heck? Why are you doing this to me? Weird. Okay. Weird! that we have no means of expedient travel like we did at the relays in Mass Effect Trilogy. Like, I think, I think it's supposed to be excused by the fact that, like, we're in, the, we're in one system or something, but this is a very prolific system, then. <laughs> like, these are systems, and then, like, we're at, the, the whole entire thing is the galaxy, you know? And so we're just traveling around in the galaxy, like, woo doo 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 <laughs> Like, okay. Whatever. I was kind of thinking they might do something with remnant tech to like facilitate travel, but I guess not. I thought it'd be kind of cheesy to recreate the relays anyway. So. Oh yeah, I need to get snacks. Extensive movie night that I've seen or heard about, but I don't know how it'll work for me because apparently you're supposed to cuddle with your loved one. But I don't know if Reyes will come up to my ship just for a movie night. That'd be fun though. Okay. Oh, I guess, let's see. That's the Andromeda Initiative. On Aya, Mariko. Oh, can I do that right now? At least get something off my list. You came back. I have bad news. Your supplier, Keldo. The cat got him. Thank you for confirming how he died. You have his supplies? Keldo ran weapons for the Resistance. You were his contact. Good, good. Continue. <laughs> Ephra asked you to test me. See how I'd handle myself. And I told him you were smart. The cat had your weapons. I got them back. Yes. All of them. And Keldo's killer's dead. This is good. You're honest, Pathfinder. Reliable. I'll tell Ephra you did well. How many more of these tests do I have to pass? <laughs> we don't trust outsiders. But maybe we can work with you. Need to get the weapons where they belong, but... Keldo would want me to help you. I have things you can use, and I want to see your credits for myself. Trade? Oh, sure. Resources are scarce for us. If you'll take credits, I'll trade. It's a start. My inventory's open to you. Anything you need. You got any nomad stuff? No? Well then, what good are you? Blah, blah, blah. Eh! 
Ooh. Ooh. That's cool. Platinum. Boring. He has no weapons. No armor. Just mods. And resources. Well, that's cool. That's good. I want to go talk to my wife. Oh, hey, humans. Venturing into space only to find more of your own people? We discovered the first real plot instead of curious. We found humans. Gives me chills just thinking about it. Huh? I guess that's kind of what happened with these guys? Like, there's no biological diversity in this system? Ha 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 ha, boring. That's my big one that I don't like about this, is that they don't have any other aliens. Like, what's the point? Rose from nothing to touch the stars, made homes on many worlds. Do not mourn what the kit stole from us, celebrate still what still remains. All things reach their end and make way for new life to fill the void. The worlds and people we lose will turn in time, family grows forever. We dedicate, dedicate, dedicate this garden to those who are not here with us, but will, who will one day return. This place is for them. Aww. Uh, da -day -da -day -da -day. Let's see where. Moshe. Where's the Moshe? Moshe. Or should I go visit this really quick? I'm busy. I'm busy. I'm also really indecisive. I don't sell it. You don't need it. If <laughs> I don't sell it, you don't need it. Nice. Nobody's there at the discussion forum. Uh, is this the way? Yo. Yo, Dre. Hey. Hey, kid. Hi. Uh, am I going the right way? Yeah, I gotta, like, go around. Right. Yeah, yeah. Oh, is this the repository, though? Or, like... Is that where I'm headed? I thought the museum was closer to the start. Oh, hey, look. Oh. When I signed up, I was working in building museums and enjoying alien cultures. I came to establish communities, not integrate with an advanced civilization. That's funny. Well, what did you guys honestly expect? They were as curious about us as we are about them. It was a lot to assemble on short notice. Yeah. Yeah. Is it? Well, that's the cat stuff, and this is human stuff. Wait, um, and not just human stuff. The Milky Way stuff. Smaller and darker than Andromeda, the Milky Way is home not only to species we've met, but also to countless sentient life forms, from the graceful Hanna to the powerful Elcor. Dozens of unique species coexist, making the Milky Way a cultural and social melting pot. They got a soccer ball. They got like a tape recorder coffee pot helmet uh alcohol books uh cereal playing cards is that a weapon i think <gasps> hi i know you're not my wife but hi hello pathfinder bye i'll let you get back to it Remnant. Oh, these are the things I've gathered, oh, right? Here. Welcome to my favorite place in the galaxy. Hi! Pavoa, I'm glad they finally let you into the city. You deserve it. This is Aya's cultural museum and history archive. It's small, but you've already made it brighter. I'm glad. I'll come back when I have something. I'm glad. Stars guide your travels. You do. That's like a weapon and a helmet and... Oh, let's see. Until recently, we knew this was a cat tool, but didn't understand its purpose. Scholars have recently determined its use in the exaltation of our people. Though it may be difficult to look at, it's important we learn and understand exaltation to protect ourselves and our loved ones. Ooh, creepy. Okay, and this is the Angara helmet. In the time before the Scourge, 
alien guard and pilots wore helmets while covering vast distances between planets. It's speculated that remnant technology was used in its helmet's construction, attracting the Scourge's attention. And... And Garn Dagger. Dagger dates back nearly four centuries to the time just after the Scourge appeared. Faced with technolo technological dark age, our ancient ancestors learned to fight and hunt without the use of advanced weaponry. Yeah, well, it certainly looks pretty advanced. It's beautiful. Datapad. Mother, you wouldn't believe what's happened happen this since Pathfinder Rider landed on Aya. I'm sure you know about the Moshe's rescue, but I suspect you've only heard the official version. Ephra and his resistance like to claim credit for bringing her home, but I know for a fact they could have never accomplished it without the Pathfinder. People fear these new aliens will turn out to be like the Ket. Don't listen to them. I, I feel in my spirit they've come to help, and you know I'm always right about these things. I wish you could see some of the interesting relics we found on Havarl and elsewhere. I'll bring images next time I visit. Also, I'm not seeing Aito anymore. It was nothing particular that ended things. They're just too different. Don't worry, my work still brings me all the happiness I need. Vela! <laughs> Pretty marry me. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. Can I, like, is it, like, me putting stuff in here, or what? What's this? This pottery fragment is believed to be a ceremony ceremonial decoration from the ancient temples of Havarl. What? Space dead. What is it? While we can't know for certain theories about the remnant device suggests its function may be to convert rock and sand into nutrient rich soil. Oh my gosh. Baby! What's up, baby? Hello, hello, baby. Hello, baby. I love seeing our Milky Way peeps mingling with the yeah. Angara. It's early in our interspecies relationship, but I hope we can build on the momentum. We have an amazing opportunity and a great responsibility. Whoa, that's your inspiring voice. I knew she wasn't gonna like that. that mode once it's on, can you? <laughs> Just riding you, rider. Keep up the good work. Thanks. Um. Is this the door I want? Maybe? Look, a human! That they wouldn't just put the drill and Elcor and blah 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 wouldn't be just relegated to a DLC. I'm kind of hoping that they introduce them in the next game. Nope, I went. Wait. So she was like in the back in the hallway in there? Makes sense that she stays in here, but. Aha! Aha! Uh -huh. Ephra should have come to me. Axel! Axel, I'm alright. You almost died. He still cares about her. What's she doing here? I asked the Moshai to set up a meeting. I don't want us to be enemies. Is this true? Axel, Ryder rescued me from the Ket. She risked her life to... Sloane Kelly saved Kadara. Look how that went. I want to be allies. Equal allies. <laughs> you don't even treat your own equally. Isn't that why the Krogan left? How did you... I've been watching you. You're invaders just like the Ket. Except less cautious. Interesting. What does that mean? You'll know soon enough. Do not trust them, Chauvin. Axel... He didn't used to be like this. He was curious, brilliant. But the cat, even without exaltation, they change us. There's still time to bring him around. I want to believe that, but his hatred towards aliens. I'll prove we can be trusted. I hope so. Ryder, we just received an emergency recording from- Oh Bruce. boy! Come to the meeting room when you get back to the Tempest. Oh boy. How's it going, Moshe? I found a device Ben was using to communicate with the Archon. I think we can use it to triangulate that Ket flagship's nav point. All you have to do now is board it, steal the Meridian artifact, and escape 
in one piece. <laughs> well, when you put it like that, it doesn't sound so impossible. Don't make light. You're venturing to a place of horrors you cannot imagine. No one has attempted anything like this before. For all our sakes, you must succeed. Now it's my turn. Evra informed me that the despot of Kadara Port, one of your people, executed Ventarev. Uh... Sloane is on her own? I do... Sloane isn't with my people, and she doesn't speak for us. Her actions spoke loud enough. She had no right to kill Ven. What he did was inexcusable, not unforgivable. This isn't what I wanted. <sighs> Regardless, it's done. Oh, hey. We could chat. Okay. We'll just my chat for a bit. My translator doesn't know what to do with your title, Moshai. Because it isn't a title. It's a reference. People from mythological times, before the Scourge. Legends say we once had many Moshai. Master inventors of unfailing wisdom, guided by boundless compassion. So she's the only one. That's a lot to live up to. It's nonsense. Don't remember who first called me Moshai, but I do recall telling them to shut up. <laughs> to my regret, the name stuck. I've minded less lately. Being the Moshai has its uses. I'm sure. I'd like to know more about you. What about me intrigues you? You're an expert on several topics. Remnant, cat, stuff I don't even know exists. All true. Why? Do you want to be my student? Yes. Is that an option? Because I didn't train for this job. <gasps> at all. Nice! Yet you do it well. There are two kinds of knowing. What we take in from the universe, and what's already inside us. You have the essentials figured out. The rest you can Why? learn as you go. Why do people keep thinking that I can do that? <laughs> what are you working on these days? I thought <laughs> what being you working a on these prisoner days? was the worst fate imaginable. Then I got home and saw my backlog. <laughs> a Vela comes in every so often asking if I have a second. At this rate, I'll never catch up. To answer your question, I'm busy with everything and nothing. We'll see which wins. <laughs> are you originally from Maya or someplace else? I was born on a research vessel in deep space. My parents were explorers. They never stayed in one place long. My own work has taken nice, me to I every like that. world many times over. They all try to claim me as their own, but if I'm honest, my favorite chair is here. <laughs> you and my crewmate have a close relationship. Any advice? Hints? He talks in his sleep. <laughs> uh, worth it for the look on your face. Jarl <laughs> is a dear and hopeless former student. He has a good spirit. You're lucky to have him, that's all. Any ideas on how we stop the cat for good? The real question is, how do we define victory over them? Oh Can man, making my life complicated. Unlikely, costly, and morally dubious. Drive them away? How? What stops them from returning? Peaceful coexistence doesn't seem to be an option. There's much we still don't know. The cat are not a simple problem. We can't reduce them to a simple solution. Why are you making my life When the cat are gone, if we fix all these worlds, what do the Angara want? Depends who you ask. We're individuals. Paran will continue spreading hope and optimism. I don't know what Ephra will do without an enemy to fight. Retirement won't suit him. As for me, maybe I'll just fade away. No, she'll That's be like leading the cultural no revolution. Needed, right? Thank you, Moshai. Ishare. Ishare. You have a cool room. Can I read your mail? Do you just link these vault plans? So much of it still remains a mystery, not that we haven't tried. Still, after what happened, it, maybe it's best to leave the vault alone now. It's been so long on Aya striving to learn whatever we can about the remnant and their amazing constructs. I see our future in these remnant plans. Call it intuition, scientific intuition, if you will, but I've marked it down here for posterity. We'll see what unfolds. She's got cat stuff in here. I guess this must be like a uh, storage vault or something. Access the vid car, the damage. Here we go, running around. Don't mind me. Wait, can I just. Can I just. Can I just please? Yes. 
<laughs> Please give me an easy option. I do enjoy hearing all the talk and stuff, but I just wish some things were shorter. It didn't take so long to get everywhere. That was interesting though that I was able to go to her and we haven't we haven't translated or powered up or whatever the device yet, but I could tell her like, hey, you know, we've got it and we're gonna see what it does. And I wonder if I had come to her after we did it, if things would have been a little different. I didn't even think about going to visit her, to be honest, ever. I didn't even know where she was, really. Gil's been asking if you can come by. I'm sure he has. I'm sorry to bother you to make to keep, you know, making you having to relay that message. Oh, hey! You always look hungry. You better watch the capacitors or he'll end up extra crispy. <laughs> That's my baby. Bitcoin channels already, Pathfinder. Okie doke. Distress call. Right from Eos. Suvi, play the full distress call from Padromos. Right away. This is the initiative outpost Padromos on Eos. We're in need of assistance. Tempest, this one is for you. We've got hostiles inbound. No ground activity, but there soon will be. Pathfinder, we need you. Going dark until it's resolved. We're not giving up Eos again. Out. Hmm. Could use more information than just hostiles and the worry of escalation. Could be he's worried it's not a simple attack. If someone's willing to risk attacking Prodromos, your first outpost... They're trying to make a point. That's the last we heard? Nothing else? No rider. But also no alarms. The orbital buoy isn't showing any major traffic. Bradley's military, all about the prep. I bet it's a brown out to present less of a target. Keep the nav fresh. I'll be on the bridge soon. Understood. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know, and I'd be kind of like, oh, no, if I didn't know this wasn't connected to Jal's thing. Like, I'd be like, what? Who could it be? I'd probably think it was Kit, but since it's all connected to Jal's, obviously, like, up in the corner there, it's like, mm. I was just saying I hadn't been to Eos in a while. Hello, buddy. All right, actually, I'm going to call this one here, haha, -ha, because uh, it's been an hour, almost, and we haven't really done much, but, you know, I've done some things, and it's a good place to call it here, otherwise Giles' mission is going to be cut in, like, a weird spot, I assume. But, anyway, since I mentioned Eos, now we're going to go back, I guess. But, uh, thank you guys for joining me, I appreciate it. Stay tuned for the next one, where hopefully really exciting, awesome things will happen. And I will see you next time.